ladies, Anna here. Um, I told you that I would give you an update um, on my ultrasound, and I'm so excited to show you guys. Since my camera doesn't zoom, I will hold it up by my face. Um, so here, the baby's head is on the right side, and then there are two little arm nubs, and then down below are his, her little leg buds and then the second one down here showed the heartbeat and the heartbeat was 174 beats per minute so super strong awesome couldn't ask for a better ultrasound I was so nervous going in um, I talked to my husband about going to Babies R Us but we were super nervous and didn't want to make any final plans because we didn't know how the ultrasound was going to go and we've never made it this far. So um, once I, once he said, everything looks great, I started crying and then he turned the screen towards me and I could see this little baby. Um, and it just blew me away and I couldn't stop crying and so I cried so much today and uh, then when he measured the heartbeat I could hear the heartbeat <laughs> and I've never heard the heartbeat before um, with my first pregnancy I saw the heart flicker and they measured that to be 120 beats per minute which was great but <clears throat> And I never got far enough along that I could actually hear it. Oh my gosh. So um, I told I started crying even harder when I heard the heartbeat and I was telling my husband, oh my gosh, I've never, I've never heard that before. And the doctor asked me, um, have I gotten this far before in a pregnancy? And I told him no. And then he said, well, next time you come in, which is in two weeks, um, let me know and I will make a audio recording of the baby's heartbeat and you can just take it home with you, turn it into your ringtone, <laughs> um, but yeah, it's yours. So I was like, oh my gosh, that would be amazing. Ah. So I'm super excited for two weeks from, from today, um, or two weeks from yesterday, yeah, so in, yeah. In about two weeks. Okay, so we went to Babies R Us because it was so awesome and super positive. And um, the only purchase that I made were new stylish C bands. But they're not actually C bands, they're like Psy bands. They're nausea relief. Um, and they came in this like striped like a dark red with pink and orange stripes on them and it's kind of like a watch band um, and another cool thing about these is that they're adjustable so the white dial right here you turn left or right and it actually presses harder on your your acupuncture I don't know if you could see that but there's a bump there because I've been wearing them all day because my nausea was insane today. Um, the hardest bit of nausea I've ever had was this morning and yeah so I got these they're they're cuter <laughs> and I can actually I feel like I can wear them and they just look like bangles on my wrist so I like that and then I decided I saw this little wipe case and it was all Mickey heads um, and like little outlines of Mickey and I was like I want this I want to register for it and I want it and so um, that being said I signed up for the baby registry at Babies R Us so we didn't register for like the nitty-gritty like clothes or anything like that or stroller or car seat but just like little items like a like a toiletry set for the the baby that was like green so gender neutral and um, pacifiers that were Mickey um, which I really liked 
and uh, we looked at some different crib sets to sort of um, see what kind of furniture we liked and and yeah so that was really cool after I was done oh and some cute frames oh my gosh these like baby's first year frames are amazing so I registered for some of those and um, yeah so those kinds of things not like we didn't go overboard with anything but after I was done I gave them back the little trigger gun thing and they handed me this bag that was full of goodies and so I wanted to share with you what I got I got a Similac nursing mom um, breastfeeding supplements which is pretty cool I don't really like taking medication um, this is vitamin E DHA and lutein but I I rather take like mother's milk tea or something like that um, because I don't do pills, you know me. <laughs> I don't swallow pills. And these things are monsters. They're huge. So I don't actually know if I will be using them. Um, the other thing that they gave me were five packs of these, um, baby registry things to put in my, um, um, <laughs> I'm drawing blank my baby shower invites <laughs> so I have a bunch of these saying hey I'm registered here which is really cool and then a huge pack like a welcome pack that gave me information on who to call about getting a free breast pump from my insurance they'll help me fill out the paperwork and tell me what I am qualified for some pretty cool coupons came with it there's a free babies are us bib and then also little um, samples of butt paste, which is zinc oxide, 16% zinc oxide. So I think, I mean, that's like, um, you could buy zinc oxide as sunscreen. So I think that once I'm done using this, I'll probably just buy the sunscreen. And then a little stain remover with coupon. Um, yes nursing pads. This is pretty cool. $20 gift card to Shutterfly. So that's pretty awesome. <laughs> Some of the coupons expire um, in just a couple of months. So I probably wouldn't buy them. Like there was a diaper coupon and I plan on cloth diapering. But if we are traveling or if it's just not convenient or doable, I'll probably use disposable. <clears throat> so, but that one expires like way before my due date, so I probably won't use the, the coupons. They also gave us breast milk storage bags, which I thought was super cool. Um, I talked to my husband while we were, sorry my dogs are crazy, They're barking up a storm. Um, talked to my husband in the, the store and he said that he would really like to feed the baby as well. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is breastfeed and then I saw in here this bottle that was supposed to be really good for both breastfeeding and bottle feeding. Um, so like a, it's a reusable wide um, bottle and it's more naturally shaped and it vents and yeah. It's great for if you are going to do both. And then last but certainly not least, this super cute Pampers wristlet, which I think is adorable. Gender neutral too. Came with a tiny little diaper. So cute. And this small pack, excuse me, <laughs> of um, sensitive Pampers wipes and it's resealable too so I really really liked getting this I thought it was super cute and I could use it for sure I wish this was like Jenny Wagner 
um, she's on that channel, that one couple. She has one that is, I think, JJ Cole, and it's a changing pad that also has little pockets for these things. So I was like, oh my gosh, that just makes more sense <laughs> than having to carry this around and then a changing pad or, you know, whatever. But this is super cute and I'll probably use it. Maybe, maybe not for, um, those specific things, but maybe I'll put extra wipes or um, wipes and pacifier wipes or whatever. So yeah, that's my update for today. Oh, I am measuring eight weeks, one day. So I thought I was eight weeks, two days. I am not worried at all that I'm measuring one day behind. So yeah, my due date would be April 20th instead of April 19th, which is fine. Um, and who knows, the baby might catch up or whatever. <laughs> so I'm super excited. <laughs> and it's really surreal and amazing that I've gotten this far. So best of luck to you guys out there still trying. Um, baby dust to you all. I love you guys. <laughs> Good night.